Well, I'm sitting here, y'all, with my new grandbaby. His <laughs> name is Dion Lionel. Say hi to everybody. Hey, Gamma. Hey, man. Hey, again, mommy. <laughs> and there you see you sitting here with your aunties, and they 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 came to celebrate my birthday. I'm so glad. <laughs> happy I'm so girl. happy. I'm so happy. Nikki's here. Oh, and Dion's here. Oh my goodness, and my grandbaby's here. This has been the best birthday I've ever had in my life, Jackie. <laughs> this has been the best birthday. I thank y'all for celebrating. Thank you, Precious, for coming. Happy birthday, Grandma. You feel like you just woke up. You just woke up. But it's, so, it's a blessing to have such a, um, a wonderful gift to the family. And yes. I'm just so grateful to have a new grandbaby. Jackie, yeah. you know what it is to have a grandbaby. Oh, yeah. You got two, right? Two little girls. Two. Oh, <laughs> and they are just so precious. So yes, precious. they are. Yes, so, um, y'all yeah, got something. Okay, so um, I think right now what we're going to do, Twinkie, is we're going to interview her. What do you think about okay, that? Yeah. Oh, that would be um, because nice. Because she does it all the time, and I think that it would really be a nice um, curve to let the people see us interview her yes. for a change. So you want to ask your questions yeah, first? Y'all are a little better at it than I am. No, okay. I'm going to kick it off. Okay. <laughs> do you really get on Twitter or Facebook? Yes, I do. I get on both. Um, I like Twitter better. Um, uh, the reason why I like Twitter is because... Um, you know, it's not so much going on 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 um, on Twitter. You know, and you can announce where you're going, um, where you've been, and that kind of thing. People right. really do respond, and I, I appreciate that. Go to the next mm -hmm. one. And what is your favorite Clark sister era? 70s, 80s, 90s, or 2000s? Oh my goodness, that's a good question. Ah, uh, 70s, 80s. The 80s, um, because I think that's when uh, you brought the sunshine, was it? Right. Yeah, you brought the sunshine was when uh, we were really made popular to the world. And so that's something we'll never forget. And thank you, Twinkie. You're welcome. <laughs> I couldn't it have... do it without them. Oh, God, yeah. And this Dorinda is the one that... the preacher in the group. Ah. <laughs> but she's the one that wrote that you brought the sunshine. And we will always be indebted to Twinkie. That's right. Keeping us out Hallelujah. here like that. <laughs> okay, well, Dorinda, can you tell, um, tell your listening audience some of the things that Mama did to influence you um, and how you felt... Um, from the things that mama taught you. Oh, Some, something special that maybe we don't always talk about, but something that um, we, um, that, that's, that stands out in your, in your mind yeah. that, we, that we did together or yeah, that mama did with you. I think it was, um, it's basically discipline. Mama really put that discipline in us. Um, um, we hear it all the time, well, we say it all the time to our, our listeners that uh, mama always disciplined us when we were going uh, wanted to go outside and play, but she made us come in to rehearse, mm -hmm. which was really important. And that's what made us into what we are today because it made us have a love for what we do. Right. So um, her discipline is something that we'll never get. And I think that everybody that has been under her leadership can really say that she has been a disciplinarian right. that has really, really, um, you know, helped us. And then really was really stern about us knowing who God was for right. ourselves. Right. So that's one of the things that I can really, really um, kind of always remember about mom. Right. Yeah. Well, before we go any further, Dorinda, we have a birthday video that we're going to show. Oh, what? OK. Another surprise. Yes, oh. a surprise. Oh. Another one. <laughs> DJ, we got another surprise. <laughs> Let's see. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear auntie. Dorinda, auntie Dorinda. Happy birthday to you. I love you. Happy birthday. And I'm wishing you great, 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 great love and happiness and peace, joy and goodness and all that good stuff. I love you and thank you for all that you have done to contribute towards my career. 
Love you and happy birthday. Bye. Hi, my name is Pastor John P. Key, and I've got the story of stories. When I was 18 years old, I was in concert, one of my first concerts with the family, and the promoter was not going to let me sing because they had run out of time. And it was at, at that point where Dr. Clark said, no, we're going to let the baby do his number. And I think Dorinda either smiled at me or winked at me, and I took it the wrong way. And so I had like, uh, like love issues early on, but I got over it, you know. I just want you to know you have blessed the body. You know you're my sister and I love you so much. You've always been genuine and this is the reason I love you. You've always been consistent. I want you to have the happiest birthday. I know how old you are. You know how old you are. But real talk on the street, they say you're 25 years old. I love you, sis. Mwah! Hey, sis. What's up? It's a blessing to be able to stand here on this day to wish the knee baby. Oh my goodness, we can go way back. Mm -hmm. Remember I used to follow you to school and you don't want me to follow you because you had them boyfriends? Uh-huh. Oh, but thank God he delivered you. <laughs> but I'm just so happy to be able to stand here and to wish you, sis, a happy birthday. I'm sorry I couldn't be there. I'm on the road with Kiera. But I want to thank you for even contributing so much naturally and spiritually into my life. I wish you a happy birthday. And girl, you look good in your old age. I love you. <laughs> now, were you surprised? I was. Surprise for real. It was so funny because Kira just did that was Sunday. Sunday yeah. Y'all done, done did things in secrecy and I didn't know it. Y'all okay. okay. Wow. It's okay. You're so deserving of it. Thank and we you. appreciate all of the things that you've done. We're going to get back to ask you a few more questions oh, before wow. our time is wrapped up. Okay. I think a lot of people would like to know um, how do you select your songs when you get ready to do a concert? What's in your iPod that you, how do you go about selecting what you're going to sing when you're going to do a concert? Well, it, it, um, it really depends on what type of service it is, because mm -hmm. I always do it, um, you know, select my songs like that. If I'm going to an anniversary, of course, I try to do songs that are appealing to who we're actually honoring. If I'm doing a concert concert, I try to do what is um, <clears throat> on that agenda you know, for that particular service. But it's so important that I be led by God to pick the right songs because you just never know when the Holy Ghost is gonna right. show up. Right. And so that's that's basically how I um, I pick my songs. Okay, spirit. now another thing, how is, when you, um, when you think about what you're gonna do and you got your mindset, how do you prepare yourself uh, prior to um, getting ready to do, to minister? Because being, being that you are the great minister that you are. Um, I always say that uh, there's no other female minister who ministers the way you do, only because I know where you came from, from 16 years old wow. to now. You are professional. Amen. <laughs> hey. I appreciate it. So when you're ready to minister, how do you, how do you prepare yourself for that? Well, you know, I, I try to have that time with God, uh, and it's so, so important because there's no way that I could know how God is leading us right. until, you know, I, I have that time with God. He said, if you, you be with me um, in secret, then I can reward you openly. And so that's how God does. And I, I have to be very prayerful. I try to fast and pray and so that God can lead me um, in that particular realm that I'm in when the Holy Ghost falls. So that's one of the things. I fast, I pray. I have to read my Bible. I can't go without reading my Bible because right, right. I just never know what God is going to give me for that particular audience. audience. Yes. Um, now, my last question is, if you had an opportunity to um, sing with any star, any, any professional person that you could sing with, what has been your, in your aspiration that you've never um, shared with anybody that you wish you could do a song with or sing oh, with? Oh, my goodness. That's a really good question. Um, and everybody knows that who's my mentor? <laughs> Mama Shirley. <laughs> <laughs> and I hope 
favorite. Yeah, I want y'all to tweet Mama Shirley or tweet tweet her and let her know that she is my favorite. I love her she so is. very, she very is. much. <laughs> they know that I love Shirley <laughs> Caesar. Love Shirley. And um, but she is the one that I, I'm really hoping and maybe probably the next album we can do something yeah. with her. That would be awesome. Yes, yes. Because I remember uh, when she, when she used to come to Detroit and and uh, we were going back her up. Yes. You really, really yeah. thought she was a junior was. Shirley Caesar. That was Shirley She Caesar. really did. <laughs> you know, but we we had to pat her on the back and say, that's okay, babe. Right, right. <laughs> she would keep on doing it. She would go, good God <laughs> almighty. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, nah. I was Shirley Caesar to my heart, yeah. <laughs> I did. I love Shirley Caesar, but that is one that I would really and love. Who, to okay, be. so you got two more people, and then we're gonna two? be done. Um, oh God. Mm, is there anybody so secular that you would like to sing? Would you like to have you done know what? something? I with? would love to do something with um, 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 Evelyn Turnty, AG. Okay, she's another. She All was right. one of the surprises she, too. Okay, yeah, awesome. So I would love to do something with her. Um, and then it's just so many. It's so I know. many, but um, that would be be really those, those are the two people that you would really like to do something yes, with. That would yes. be awesome. And I'll say Stevie. Okay, good. All Stevie right. song, I'm still here with me on stage. Oh, he and that sure was a, did. Yeah, so I would like to do something. Yeah, that. Him. Okay, so that's that's yeah. awesome. Yes. Okay, so that's and, and my last question to you is going to be. Um, your opportunities and the things that you have uh, ascertained in life and, and as life has evolved for you, you have so many things that you're involved in and so many things that you are, um, you know, heading off and so many entities in your life. Mm -hmm. If you had to pick one thing that you had to do the most, what would it be? I think I know, but I, I'm gonna, I want you to say it. What do I... Have some downtime? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, now I, that would be yes. a good thing for you. Yes, it would. I really like, but I would like to go um, on a cruise on on the. Um, Hi. Ooh, yes, yes. <laughs> That's what Gam I want to do. <laughs> but no, I would like to go on a cruise um, on the eastern part. Okay, on the eastern um, yeah, in Mediterranean. The eastern, yes, okay. Mediterranean. Mm -hmm. I'd love to uh, really, really go there and just chill and. Have a, just just have a good time. Okay, but would you would you really um, relax and enjoy yourself? Mm-hmm. Yes, I would. Okay. I promise I you would. You would. I would. I promise. Okay. Really okay, would. okay. Well, that's to now. I feel much better now. Yeah. All right. I well, I, I'm so happy that we had an opportunity to be with yeah. you today. Yeah. We're so happy that happy that the, your staff allowed us to come and be with you, and we love you. Love y'all. Thank y'all so you. much, and thank y'all so much Bye. for <laughs> joining me on my birthday celebration.